what's going on guys this is painful here and the whole pain train well not the whole fashion but uh anyways how are you guys doing <laughs> doing good all doing right very good Forrest, i'm gonna ask you a question real quick because you know yes. why not questions are nice okay so what would the first thing you want to do today in today's video what what's the first thing you want to do well probably just go out and pvp <laughs> Really? Uh -huh. Be more specific. Like, do you want to go nether? We can go end. I mean, wait, slash up list. Okay. Because the pop isn't too bad, I wouldn't see it to be a problem to go and exit again. But you know, end. Or go end? end. Yeah, we could, we could possibly... What the fuck? What the heck is that? <laughs> what? <laughs> Yo, reframe, are you okay over there, buddy? Yeah, I'm fine. Oh, okay. What's um, wrong with you, kid? <laughs> there's some like possessed demon inside of him or something like that. Okay, well, bye. We'll we, we'll bring you in the next clip, I guess. This just got awkward. <laughs> All right, guys. So just before we get into PvP, um, as you saw last episode, we had a decent amount of Ender Pearls. We still do, but we could use a little bit more as well as gunpowder. We could use a bit more as well. But the other thing is with farming, um, the end cough is currently going on, so I don't think farming is really an option. So instead of farming, we might do a bit of PvP over in the nether or overworld, whatever we come to. Uh, but yeah, we got Anton back at it again in here. And guys, majority of you guys wanted to get Anton a new rank um, because obviously you didn't have a rank and he's just a really, really cool guy. So what we're going to do is we're going to surprise him with a rank right now. All right, guys, so we just got Anton the rank. This is what he says. This is what he says. No way, no way, no way, no way. Oh, my God. What the... <laughs> and then he says, oh, he's so happy that he got the rank. He said, thank you very much, guys. You guys helped make this all happen. You guys wanted him to have the VIP rank for lifetime. So there we go. He's got it for lifetime. <laughs> he's obviously freaking out about it. Uh, I don't know. He's just a really good guy, and... Uh, if, I don't know. I kind of figured he, he deserves a rank, man. <laughs> look at look at the guy. He's filled with energy. I don't, I don't even know what to say. <laughs> Whatever he's doing, he's, he's having fun. And, uh, uh, okay. Bye, Forrest. <laughs> All right, guys. So we're going to be uh, PvPing. Forrest, you can kind of explain where we're going. And, uh, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> yeah, right now, there are about two huge power facts. So end is basically off limits. And mm -hmm. nether is basically one of the best options for us. Um. Well, technically, we're just going to Nether to, to Nether to, to Nether to Overworld, really. Overworld, so, yeah. I didn't mean Nether, but yeah, we're going <laughs> to Overworld too. Wow, uh, dude, great commentary. <laughs> yeah, dude, I'm ten out of ten. Uh, we're going to Overworld to just roam around, see if we can get any good kills, any decent, like even fights, you know. Yeah. Maybe not get baited to, you know, a trap, trap every yeah. single time. See, the only disadvantage we're gonna be at now is because we don't have a bard, but we do have four diamond guys, so. I mean, we work with what we got. So, uh, yo, Zanny, are you coming as well, dude? No, I can't. I have school. So. Okay, three diamond guys. Zanny has school. All right, dude, let's freaking go. Okay. I think Anton's go. gonna be chilling down there, spawning into grinders, spawning yeah. in all the skeletons and stuff. Please don't be a power flash. Okay, we're good. I will cry. <laughs> nah, dude. I if there's a power flash in there, yo, guys, if you haven't seen yesterday's video, um, we went through there and there was a massive power faction, and we kind of got wrecked. Yeah, scratch that. I actually cried externally. Yeah. Fucking actually cry. All right, we're going down here. Luckily, we landed in the spawn. Would you die if you didn't land in the spawn? Not. Nah, you'd probably survive with like four hearts. Really? If you feather falling, yeah. What if you? You only. Really? Yeah, you only take five or six hearts from the fall if you have feather falling. Oh, wow. I'm surprised I died then yesterday. Uh, what's it called, guys? In case you didn't see, basically I got strength dude and they hit me twice and I fell down and died. So they must have done a lot of damage with the strength too. Wait, so do you want to just go to end exit then? Because there's an end cough going on, so we should be able to get a couple picks. I'm hoping that they have foam, because if they come through, dude, we have to kite. Yeah, yeah, for sure. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I no, had... I feel like people will come through, dude. <laughs> oh, man. Whatever, dude, we're okay. doing it. We're doing it for the we're vine. For the vine. <laughs> All right. Yo, That's guys, good. we'll bring you back uh, when people come. Yeah, guys, so this is pretty much the waiting game that we're playing now. Pretty much the end cough is about to be capped, so I'm assuming they're either going to F home or a big power faction is going to come through here and we're going to die. So let's hope they don't come through here. But if they do, we're pretty much ready to run. It's a 1k kite. We should be okay unless we get, like, debuffed and all that jazz. So well, let's just see if people come through. Dude, dude, dude they will come through because they have a key. Ah! 
<laughs> Yo, let's pre pot, pre pot, pre pot. I pre pot. Who captured? Let's kill the guy who captured. Uh. It's Darth, uh, Darth Kid. Kid. Darth Kid. Alright, dude. Let's slay this guy. We're, we're dude, gonna. If we actually. All right, guys. So they uh, they just kind of got their loot. Apparently, that they got really good loot for us. What did they get? Well, they got a Koth fortune, Koth looting, and Koth bow. I mean, it's decent. And it's they got me. Good. I mean, that should count as something. <laughs> okay, guys. So it's just kind of going over and kind of laughing at this just a second ago. Just like, what was I thinking? Obviously, they're gonna come <laughs> through. A huge power faction. Like, why would we even be there, dude? That's the last place we'd want to be. So why... What in the world is wrong with us? <laughs> Specifically me, I made the call. I mean, I'm the one who died, though. At least no one else had to suffer through it, but... I I'm a he freak. deserved it. <laughs> I'm a, I'm I mean, a moron, dude. I honestly, I'm a moron. Alright guys, so I'm right now just trying to repair. Obviously I just died, so I have to grind out a new set. It's taken ages, but we do have another skeleton spawner in here. Um, if you guys didn't tune into yesterday's episode, a lot happened, so I highly recommend it, guys. But anyways, uh, a guy named, what, what was it, XVP or something like that? He paid... XVP, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's he... factual and rateable. Oh, wow, that freaking sucks. Anyways, this guy gave Forrest $25,000, and we kind of used what all that money and what money we had to purchase this skeleton well to purchase a wrench or crowbar and and get this skeleton spawner here so uh for us you uh anton what, what's up oh dude he's giving us <gasps> anvils what? what a god yo guys so we were actually about to go uh mining for some just iron because we're fine on diamonds we just need iron we just need iron but it looks like anton has got us he's got our bag dude anyways uh back to the story yo do you have a do you have a pickaxe by chance yep all right, just mine up. make it more efficient, though. Like, if we expand the little area there. Okay, let, let's make it more efficient, then, because, I mean, why not? We need a lot of these to spawn, and it kind of takes forever with one spawner, so let's set up a two-spawner thingy. All right, guys, so this is the problem. What? Um, All of them got <laughs> stuck. There's a hundred and... I didn't and... see them. <laughs> Dude, why is there a hole in our dang wall anyways? I don't know who put that there. <laughs> This is why I was waiting ages, because whenever they were spawning, they were being put into a wall, I guess. Yeah, someone... I don't know who did this. <laughs> someone, someone, what... Someone's out to troll us or something. Like, what is this? I don't know. It's like a... <laughs> Yo, just secret. just patch up the hole so that... Anton's coming up in here. Um, patch up the hole so that doesn't happen. And patch up this hole over here as well if you have blocks. Okay, because... yeah, we don't need a place to... Well, let's... I don't know. We're gonna have... I don't know what we're gonna do with it. Do what? you want to just place it anyway? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I want to just place it. Just put put one like right here, right here. Put the uh, put the block, right where I'm swinging, right there. Yeah, right there. Okay, and then we'll have one right over there as well. All right, cool. So now we're gonna have a crap done. It's just that's where they were stuck. I was wondering. I was like, okay, I've been sitting here for literally like five minutes. Nothing was coming down at all. Turns out they're all in a dang wall. How much do we have here now? Yeah, 166. GG. Okay, you're good. Hey right, guys, apparently there's a bard outside, and if we kill him, his whole faction goes raidable. So, <laughs> you know what we're about to do. Oh, he's right, shooting. Go. Wait, what? Oh. oh my god, he's hacking hard. Oh my Where god. is he? He's hacking hard. Oh he's my god. Wow. Yeah, good. very. Oh, he just fell into a trap. Oh. He hit reframe into a trap while. Yo, I, I have. Yo, I'm gonna pre pearl and save you. I'm pre pearling on you. I'm. I'm. Dude. I'm shooting him. He's dead, dude. He's, he's dead. got regen hacks, oh, bro. I, what? Yo, I'm in the trap as well. Oh my god, dude. Oh, he's dead, dude. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my he's god. He's rateable, dude. He's rateable. Uh, go to his base. I should have to warp this. Um, yeah, that's kind of stupid. We got into yeah, a trap. Yeah, he has no HQ. Never mind. Whoa. Who's King K? Uh, oh, okay. Alright, guys. So this guy named String Traps here requested to 1v1 me. I'm right here, homie. Yo, homie. Are, are you freaking blind? I hit you. Dude. <laughs> Sir. Hello. Do you see me? God. Okay, yes, yeah, you, okay? <laughs> come on over here. He's in the faction Red Gang. He's gonna come and 1v1 us in the Sky Arena that Ziggy built. Let's just bring him down here, guys. And I think we have another 1v1 after this. I'm not too sure yet, but um, if we don't, whatever, we'll continue on with the Let's Play. Um, but yeah, here it is right here. We're gonna go straight up to the arena now. Guys, type in the comments who do you think is gonna win. Oh, Anton came up here as well. <laughs> Oh god. Alright, dude. Let's do it. Best of luck, bro. Okay, guys. So, String Traps is obviously here. He just asked my teammates for a couple of pots. Um, one thing I want to uh, make sure that you guys understand is when you guys want to come over here in 1v1, make sure you have pots because 
It's kind of annoying for us having to give you guys pots because we're not really making any profit other than your armor if we kill you. Oh my goodness, dude. Um, but yeah, pots are very... I, I'd prefer pots than armor, honestly. If this guy died and had a full pot loaded, I'd much rather pot load it than armor just because we have like a dub and a bit of armor already, so it's not really that valuable to us anymore unless it's like unbreaking. Um, but yeah, make sure you guys come here with potions if you guys do want a 1v1. Um, he's panicking, dude. <laughs> I think he's shaking or something, dude. He can. His aim's a little bit off. Not gonna lie. He's panicking. He's probably like, "Oh my god, it's painful PVP." <laughs> I don't know. If you guys remember a long time ago when I first started HCF, my first time ever logging into an HCF server, there was about seventy spectators, and I one v one Stimpy for my first time. And at the time, okay. I was a huge fanboy Simpy and I, I was shaking so bad and I almost had like a heart attack dude my heart was like going insanely fast and it <laughs> I feel like this guy's like going through that same situation right now so string traps I'm sorry if I give you a heart attack bro not trying to just trying to have a good fight here but uh, this fight's pretty much over he's he's got he's like double potted every time he's single potted so yeah. he, dude I've, I've only used I think like four bots or something but oh man <laughs> it's just, poor guy, dude. <laughs> dude. Poor guy, indeed. Hey, dude, he challenged me. It's not like... Oh, yo, oh he's crying out Anton. He's crying out Anton, dude. What? Jump this kid. <laughs> oh, dude, he's Jump dead. him. Yeah, dude, you made the wrong decision. <laughs> yeah, he had no pots anyways. Kid trusted crit out Anton. Dude, Anton tanked it, though. He's a god, dude. Dude, this kid is a god. <laughs> <laughs> this is why we love Anton. What a god. Oh, my god. All right, guys, so something a bit different here. I'm not actually going to be in this 1v1, but it's going to be Easy XD versus Forest. And I've got all high hopes on Forest. I mean, Easy in yesterday's Let's Play didn't do that well, so I don't think he will beat Forest because Forest, uh, Forest is really good at pot PvP, so he, shouldn't, uh, he should not beat Forest. I mean, hopefully Forest doesn't panic or anything. But, uh, yeah, place we're just going to... Place your bets, gonna, folks. Place yeah, your bets. Place your bets. I, I got all, all bets on Forest, um, and I'm just going to kind of commentate this fight as well. All right, guys, here we go. Okay, Easy's going in on Forest. Who? Okay, so first off, they're trading fairly well. E oh, Forest got the extra hit on there. That's what I like to see. Hashtag pain train. Let's go, boys. Get, yo, guys, make sure you guys type hashtag pain train in the comments down below as well. And if Forest wins this, guys... You guys gotta support Forrest down below as oh well. Oh my god. Come on, Forrest, you got this, dude. You got this. Oh! oh don't wait, kill what? him, don't kill him, don't kill him, don't kill him. What the heck? We are not scumbags over here in Pain Train. Obviously, we could easily kill this guy. It seems like he's. Oh, oh, what, what, what? Okay, he's, he's back. He's back. I think he. Uh, what the heck? I don't know what's wrong with this guy's internet, but he's good now. Oh, nice. Okay, so they're even on hits right now. Don't go for the quick drop, just play time. You can beat this guy. Yes, there you go. Good stuff, Forrest. Oh, he dropped the pot too. I yep. think you picked it up. There you go. He's panicking, dude. He's panicking. I'm respeeding. Okay, yeah, he didn't actually attack you. He's not aggro. Don't be aggro on him. Yeah. Nice. That That's respect right there, guys. When someone's potting up and not attacking them, that's just PvP respect right there. Same with eating. Oh, he missed that pot. Keep hitting him. He's going to die. Oh, he just double potted. Dude, this guy's going to be out of pots in no time, dude. As long as you're um, as long as long you're pretty conservative with your pots, you're going to beat this guy fairly. He just triple potted. Oh, my goodness, dude. Easy XD is going down, it looks like. I'd repot speed if I were you. Oh. I'm good. I'm at 50 seconds. Okay. There you go. That's the combos we're looking for. Easy XD going to be taking a lot of damage here. It gets a little circle strafe combo on Forest. Okay, yeah, dude, you've easily got this. He is double potting and triple potting basically every time he tries to pot. So, yeah, you've you've won this fight, guys. Oh, <laughs> nice dang thrill, it. dude. The oh timing. <laughs> yeah, you're you're looking pretty good right now. I'd repot speed if I were you, though. Honestly, next trade that you win, you should pearl away and repot speed, or just repot speed, whatever. You got this, dude. There you go. He had no pots. Oh my god. How many this did poor you have? Guy. <laughs> I had, uh, let's see, let's count this. Five, no, actually six, 12, 15 pots. All right, close <laughs> battle there, buddy. We appreciate you coming out. 
All right, guys, so I'm going to be doing a 1v1 here against uh, actually a pretty good player named Maxings. Um, yeah, he is pretty good, um, but I think we could do better. Hopefully we can, and if not, hey, it was worth a try, right? So apparently this guy's pretty good at PvP. I fought him a couple times on... Make uh, sure these guys don't try and pull fast one, because yeah. they were spamming the heck out of me to make a spectator arena and let them spectate. Yeah, it seems it's like spamming. they may try to bard or something like that. That's why we don't they're have any spectator arenas. They're spamming me. Let us fucking watch. Okay, oh. well, they're not watching. No, ignore them. All right, don't guys, here he is, pressure. the man of the hour, Maxings. Best of luck, bro. Best of luck. Here we go, dude. Slash message Maxings. Pot up, sir. Pot up. I think he probably thinks that bard's with me. He's actually not in our factions, Maxings. Maxings. He says he got a pee. Okay. Okay, bro, you can go pee. Yo guys, how how scummy of us how scummy of us would it be if we just quick drop this guy while he's taking a pee pee? <laughs> I can easy quick drop him right now, but we ain't gonna do that because we got the hashtag respect, dudes. Okay, we're just gonna wait for him to finish his pee pee. All right, here we go, dudes. Maxing is back. He's actually pretty quick at taking a pee pee, dude. He definitely didn't wash his hands. <laughs> Are you ready? Disc? Dude, yeah, dude. This guy was like, I don't know. He he did not wash his hands. I'll tell you that. All right. Here we go, dudes. Apparently, this guy's faction was talking a little bit of smack to us as well, so hopefully we can beat him and kind of just make his faction shut up, but I don't know. This guy's pretty good, so hopefully we can beat him. We're getting some pretty good combos on him right here. We just need to keep up the pressure. All right. Now, one thing I noticed about power factions is they... Oh, he's going to be aggro on me. Okay, I'll, I'll be aggro on you too, Max. Just keep that in mind. You aggro on me, I'm aggro on you now, bro. Whenever you try to pot up and eat, I'm gonna pearl on you like you did to me, bro. Yeah, there we go, okay. We won that trade there, let's just keep it up. All right, so what I was saying about uh, power factions is they're very cocky because there's so many of them, right? They feel, it's like when you're with a group of friends, you have so much more confidence. So I'm assuming that's why his power faction is talking trash, but, it, but if I talk to their power faction like one-to-one, -one, they'd actually be nice, I 100% I 100% could say that like it's like you know trying to talk to a girl all right we're, we're bringing girls into this for a second a girl isn't gonna want to you know really talk to you as much if she's with a group of friends but once she's by herself you know you can kind of connect better um it's kind of the same situation as this I don't even know where I'm going with this commentary but I'm just hoping that we're winning he's obviously getting wrecked right now but you know you can always make comebacks dude it's never the end till it's the end all right let's just keep up the pressure here <laughs> this guy is missing lots of pots. I think he's possibly a bit nervous. He's, pro he's probably got his whole faction, um, you know, yelling at his ear, and he's probably getting a bit nervous from that. And hey, man, he's got every right to be nervous, bro. All right, Maxings, let's do it, bro. There we go, guys. We are winning these trades, making him pot left and right. We're going to beat this guy with a lot of pots if it keeps going this way, dude. I'm telling you. If we just keep up this pressure, Maxings is going to go down, and we'll have a, still a decent amount of pots left. All right, so this guy's fairly aggro, but he's kind of toned it down a little bit, so this is looking good for us. Let's just go like this, and it looks like he's going to be eating food. All right, let's go. Let's go, Maxings. Let's sit. Oh, there you go. There you go. Okay, now now he's warming up, boys. Holy macaroni and cheese on top, Maxings. You got to stop with that, all right, dude? I understand you want to win, but that's enough. Oh, wow, dude. This guy's being hella aggro now. Okay. All right, Maxings. It's time for us to uh, step up our game here. Throw that aggro pro right at him. All right, looks like he's... Oh, he missed that pot. Yes, dudes. There we go, Key. Keep up these hits on him. And uh, let's go over here, eat some feed. So we still have a decent amount of pots left, probably like seven. So he should be very, very low. There we go, dudes. I think... I feel like that was his last pot. Considering how aggro he's being right now, that was definitely his last pot. <laughs> or not. Okay, apparently he has pots still. I feel like he's out of pots now, though. He's He's got to be lower than this, dude. Yeah, there we go, guys. We beat him three pots left. GG, dudes. GG. There's his uh, Cali guy messaging me. We beat him three pots left. I know we kind of messed up on a couple of our pots, but uh, you know what? I'll, I'll take a free win any day of the week. <laughs> and, um, yeah, I don't know. Their faction is just kind of... I don't know. I guess they're overconfident when they're together. So it's it's better to 1v1 them when they're alone, I guess. I, I don't even know where I'm going with this. Bye.